Hello, today I'm going to be showing you how to create page transitions using only CSS. This can be created very easily in the matter of seconds. Something like this is what we'll be creating today. To get set up here, I already have a simple HTML and CSS page, nothing too complex, just some text. And some basic responsive base. So, to start, we're going to be utilizing a CSS library titled animate.css. So to start, we're going to want to go out and grab that. Animate CSS is the first link right here. And this is the site right here. You're going to want to click to download it right here and include it into your site. To note right here is a list of all of the animations included in the library. You click each one gives you a demo of what it will look like. Also how the text is shown here is how you call it by the class. So pay attention to the camel case in here. So to create to use this to create a page transition on our HTML pages is actually very simple. First we just need to link the style sheet that we just downloaded. I'm going to cheat. What do they call it? Anime.css. Oops, that's not what I want. Uh, I did with my ID really quick. Okay, so that's now linked. Now all we need to do to create our animation is for the transition we want to tag it the whole HTML page so I'm going to go right to the HTML tag and I'm going to add a class. For this to work we actually need to include two classes. The first one is called animated. This is required by the library to show any of their animations. This is just showing that this piece of HTML will be animated. The next class is the one we actually want to call for our selected animation. So once again, here we have a list of what they all look like. And for this example, I used, I used and there you have it. That simple. If you want the files from today's video, please see the accompanying blog post in the description section. If you found this content helpful, please subscribe. That's a huge help. And if you have any ideas for future videos, please let me know in the comment section. And I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day.